The demand for testing isn't going anywhere as the Omicron variant surges across Georgia and the nation. And just as people were getting used to the idea of swapping their noses to find out if they're infected, a new idea has been introduced. Hope Ford verifies if a throat swab is better at detecting Omicron. On TikTok, user and journalist Allison Hall posted a video of herself receiving a negative result after swabbing her nose, then a positive result after swabbing her throat. Her positive result was confirmed by a PCR test. Then the hashtag swab your throat popped up on Twitter in recent days. So is a throat swab better at detecting Omicron than a nasal swab? Our sources, the FDA, the University of Hong Kong, South Africa's National Health Laboratory Service, and U.S.-based epidemiologists and researchers. This one needs context. A group of U.S. researchers studied 30 people and found saliva tests or throat swabs picked up a positive result before a nasal swab did. The study, which hasn't been peer reviewed or published, concluded Omicron is better detected by saliva. A study from South Africa, which also hasn't been peer reviewed or published, showed throat swabs detected all Omicron cases, but 71% of Delta infections, while nasal swabs detected 86% of Omicron infections, but 100% of Delta cases. Throat swabs are used in other countries in combination with nasal swabs to test for COVID-19. But in America, the FDA stands by nasal swabs, pointing to the sheer number of cases already detected by the method. The FDA adding it can be complicated to self-administer a throat swab and can cause false positives as they're not supposed to eat or drink 30 minutes before. Epidemiologist Eric Fagel-Ding telling Today, it's not that an at-home test won't pick up Omicron in the noses when swabbing there, it just might pick it up a half a day or a day later. So there's evidence to support a throat swab showed positive results for Omicron faster, but there's also evidence to show nasal swabs work well for the majority of people. Experts suggest you retest if you get a negative result with a nasal swab, but you still have some symptoms or if you were in contact with someone who had COVID-19.